I'm back with another complete collection version of the game, so this includes the latest add-on as well as the other previous DLCs. And as always, here's the download website, so you can find the link in the description below. Okay, so here's the game we're looking for. Now we're going to use uTorrent for downloading, so download and install it using this link only. I'll skip this step because uTorrent is already installed on my PC. Okay, so click this link to go to the download page. Here you can see all of the links you can use. Now we only need to use a single link. So click link one. Okay, so select uTorrent here and open the link. Now in this uTorrent window, use this button and choose a folder to save the game files. So this is where I will save it in this folder. Okay, now hit OK to begin the downloading. So you can see it's downloading now. All right, so leave it for some time so that it can pick up some speed. I'll pause the recording and complete the downloading and be back afterwards. Okay, I'm back after finishing the download. You can see here. Okay, so stop the torrent now and right click on the game and click open containing folder to go to the download folder. Okay, so you'll see this ISO file here. Double click the ISO file and it'll give you the game DVD here. Okay, so open the DVD. To start installation, double click this file. Okay, I'll use my game drive here, so you can keep it unchanged. I'll install the game here. This will be your install folder, so it's very important you remember which folder you're choosing here. So you can go ahead and click the install button now. It'll take five to 10 minutes to complete the installation depending on your PC, so I'll pause the recording and be back later. Okay, so you can see the game is successfully installed. Now hit finish to exit. Okay, but don't start playing yet. Again, we need to go back to the DVD. Then open this folder, copy this. Now go to the game install folder. So my install folder is on this drive. This is my install folder, so open it up, paste the files in here. Okay, now replace some files when you're asked. And we're done. Now let's start the game and see if it works. Okay, now open this folder and then this folder. Okay, so right click this file and click run as admin to start the game. Okay, so you can see the new add-on and all the DLCs are included in the game.
so we can see the game is working fine, and we also saw it contains the latest add-ons. So I'll quit now, and you can continue playing. And once again, here's the website to download the game, and you can find the link in the description.